like battling her now? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't want to do this right now. Okay. Um, but I guess I'll try. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what is this game? What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Jack Blake here. Today, welcome back. We are playing Ice Cream 2 knockoffs here today, and today is going to be fun. I am excited because we do knockoffs here every so often, and they're so weird and so broken that they're so funny. We go to the Android Play Store that literally allows this to happen, where basically you can go and find a bunch of games that are copying the real game. And today, I have a treat for you. <laughs> so as we scroll down, we can actually see that there's a game here that I already have installed that I was excited to play called Ice Cream Granny. Now, does that sound like it's copying something? Because obviously, yeah, it's, it's, it's copying like two games, Ice Cream and Granny. It's literally called Ice Cream Granny. If we look at the description, it reads, let's find out secrets of evil ice cream frozen town in, in Granny's neighborhood. It's, it's a big old wordy sentence, but we can see that all of the pictures are like of an icy town, except for this one, where we can see, I guess it would be Rod's sister, right? Um, I, Rod's sister here with a bat, I guess, taking over the role of the crazy ice cream man slash woman slash granny. I don't know. It's so weird already. But before we start, let me talk about the merch real quick. Doo -doo -doo. It is the Dak Pack merch that is literally going to be gone, I guess, in a week. By January 1st, by New Year's, this thing will be gone. I mean, look, you, you can put it like in your hand. You can have a friend here. Hey, what's up? Hi. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's your new merch, buddy. But anyways, it's gonna be gone pretty soon, so check the top right or the description if you're interested in the merch. Thank you to those who've already gotten it so far. Let's go into the game. All right, so we're here in the main menu called Scream Granny Ice Town. <laughs> Wait, when was it called Scream Granny Ice Town? Okay, you can already see this is gonna be a packed video. Uh, I guess just, it's gonna be so funny just to kind of make fun of this because I have no idea what they're doing. They're obviously trying to copy two different games and um, just look, look at this lady slash horned thing are they in a costume or are they just like some magical creature i don't know nevertheless i mean they're looking pretty sassy they got their hand on their hips they got a bat in their hands they're just basically looking at us like oh oh you want to challenge this so <laughs> i guess let's go into the game and see what's going on all right so as we enter into the world we are now finally emerged into the knockoffness of this game this looks very familiar and i think that a lot of these knockoffs are just people copying other people's games and just putting in little things it's kind of like me texture modding things that's pretty much what these people do but um i guess we're in a game where we're gonna find uh rod's sister and i'm sure we can glitch this out i don't even know where they are are they even here i swear if there's not even an enemy in this game oh there they are there they are okay so they look really weird and they run so weird hold on i could just outrun them i literally could just turn around and be like hey we're going on a run now <laughs> we're just gonna run around town for a second oh you gotta you gotta catch up here don't want you to be too tired now i swear i think if i jump onto this fence i'll probably be able to glitch the game out hold on if i can get up there i think that this could be one of the coolest glitches ever because i know that uh, oh my gosh it already is kind of did, is it? We just glitched out the game immediately. We just, <laughs> we figured it out immediately. Just like in Hello Neighbor, if you get onto a fence, the enemy's kind of like, how, how, how did you do that? What, how are you up there right now? <laughs> the funny thing is, is she kind of looks like she's out of breath. <laughs> like right now it looks like she's like, huh, huh. Yeah, I, I would have caught you if you didn't get up there. <laughs> I think if we walk between like right here and right here, she just keeps running back and forth. <laughs> Look, I can just go back here and just make her run around a car. Oh my gosh, this is perfect already. Hold on. Can we like climb? Oh, we can climb onto everything. And she can't do anything? Like this is... We just beat the game by standing on a car. Does she give up? Looks like she's giving up now. <laughs> she's not running anymore. Wait, where are you going? Hold Hold on, we're... What are you giving up on me right now? <laughs> what? What? She's like, all right, you know what? Jump on my car. I don't care. Okay, I think what we're supposed to do is grab this bat. All right, so we got the bat. Jeez. So we just... So what are we battling her now? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't want to do this right now. Okay. Um, but I guess I'll try... <laughs> Oh my gosh, <laughs> what is this game? So um, apparently that means game over. I wasn't supposed to do that, I guess. 
Um, that's a no-no by the game. They're like, why did you hit her for some reason? All right, so I got the bat. Now I'm just gonna go and punch the door. <laughs> oh my gosh, the door's shattered. <laughs> Doors don't do that in real life. What? Wait, can I just, can I go? <gasps> oh, oh, hey, hey, <laughs> hey. She does not like me breaking her house. Why is she mad? I just broke your door open and took your bat. Why are you mad? This game is so weird. It's so broken. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. Wait, that just opens? I don't have to break anything? What is that? Jeez, why is there a ghost there? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I better avoid her instead of beat her up. I guess I'm not supposed to. All right, so we're going to be heading back into our house uh, with a baseball bat. And we're just going to destroy everything now. Bah! Okay, so I think we're supposed to pick up this pumpkin. Boom, we got the pump. Oh, okay, I don't want to get hurt by you. Oh, man, I've somehow survived, and I'm just going to outrun her. Oh, no, why did I run back? Where am I going? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I... Okay, I, I lived. How? How? So I think I picked up the wrong pumpkin. I think I'm supposed to be grabbing this. I just ran through a bunch of times. But now we need to find a key, apparently. And I, I don't know where that is. I can't open up a lot of these doors, and immediately she'll kill me if uh, she finds me. And she probably will find me, but I don't know where anything is. All right, so I guess while we're here, let me do a little beatbox lesson for you. I feel like those are fun, and we don't do them enough. So if you want to do kind of like a little record scratch, I feel like it's a cool thing. Um, it's kind of like, um, say like sweet, but just like add an L between the S and the W. So like, sweet. So you get like a, you hear that? Like a, so you just kind of amplify that and you get like a, and if you can do that, you can kind of get a little bit of a scratch. Like, it's kind of like taking your tongue and and you control your bottom lip. I, it's so hard to explain how to do a lot of these sounds. It's kind of just like morph your mouth and try to make some air come out in a way that sounds like you're going swoosh. So like, but through your bottom lip, I guess. If you combine that and you combine the other things that we've done before, like the and the, you can get like a. All right, so we're sneaking once more. I just saw Rod's sister go around the back over there, and I think now is going to be the time where I actually try to find the key because I don't know where it is. I don't know where I'm supposed to be. Look, there's a witch hat. Can I take it? Can I take the witch hat? I want to be a witch. I don't even know where I'm supposed to be looking, and every single time I'm in her house, she knows exactly where I am every time. How does she know? How does she know? So I've been looking around for literally the past, like, I feel like 10 minutes, and I have not found a key at all. And I've put a barrel in a window. This game is so broken, and I think it's lying saying that there's a key in the game. It says literally, find and pick key. Which key? I, like, mm, I would like to pick that one. Like, there's no key in the game. I've been looking for so long, and at this point, I'm just, like, playing with barrels. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. But, oh, that was a perfect throw. I'm thinking maybe I have to get onto the roof. Oh, wow. Did I do it the first try? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I was almost there. Almost there. And, uh, hold on. Jump, jump, jump. Come on. There we go. There we go. And now, can I get to the roof? Okay, so I got to the roof, and um, I don't know if I'm supposed to be up here. No way. What is this? What is this? We have found something. It is... Um, oh, wait. Is that... No way. That's the key. What, what is this, then? It says, pick up granny hat. I know that the, the granny hat is inside, um, but did we find a secret? I think we might have. So yeah, there's nothing else on the roof, and I think the only thing is that granny hat inside. So we're gonna go check out the granny hat inside now, and hopefully we don't get caught in the meantime. Can we pick it up? Can we pick it up? Can we pick it up? No, let us pick it up. Okay, so we found the granny hat now, but what does that mean? Wait, we found this whole Easter egg and it led to nothing? Really? Okay, uh, well there's literally no key, and they're lying to me. Uh, look, look at this. Nothing's going on. She's still chasing me. What if we just dance around this barrel? She literally can't do anything still. <laughs> I want to throw a barrel at her because we're not allowed to hit her. Like, I don't I don't know what to do to combat her running at me constantly. So I'm going to throw a barrel at... Oh, she just runs past the barrel. Okay. Rod's sister sucks. All she does is try to hit me. You know what, Rod? Rod tries to capture me. You know, he puts me in his little stall. He tries to turn me into ice cream. I mean, what is Rod's sister doing? She's just hitting me with a bat. 
That's not fun. That's not innovative. All right, so I set the game to night, and I think that's pretty much it. I feel like this game is so fake that it didn't even give you an ending. There is no ending. There is no key. I've been walking around in this thing. I mean, the game is funny because you can literally just outrun the whole villain of the game you can take a bat right here and and just smack the villain and, and the game's like wait you can't do that no game over man like you can't kill the villain like literally if if i walk here break down the door and i see her i can literally just swing right here as she runs to the door and i think i win right wait where where did she go i walked into this house and she's usually here what is she gone? I, I don't know. I guess we can get the pumpkin again. I'm not sure. Oh, no, there she is. Uh, I, I don't know what she was doing, but we knocked her out again. You know, she isn't coming to my house. This is my house now, and um, she can't do that. She can't walk up with a bat in my house. I'm going to knock her out. I just, I don't know. I don't know. This game is so bad. I don't know which one's worse. The um, first one with Rod's little brother or um, this one with his sister. Like, they're so equally trying to, like, fake you out. Like, is this that ice cream game that you're playing or is this the granny one that you're playing? Like, no, this is neither of them. I don't know what <laughs> this game is, but it is nothing. It's just a copy. Oh, I found the key. I found the key. I found the key. I found the key. Search and grab cauldron now. I, what? What, what is going on? I, there was more to this? I, I did not prepare. Hold on, what? So I finally find the key, and this is not what I, what? All right, so I know the cauldron is here. I, I find, I found everything kind of exploring and walking around. If I don't get caught in this door, like a bill, I can't walk through the door. Jeez, okay, and now she's there. Um, but yeah, I found a bunch of stuff that um, it was supposed to be me finding it pretty easily. Apparently it wasn't. I did not find it really easily, but I know where everything is now. Um, that's the wand. Then we have to find a skull. I forgot where that skull was, but I think I've seen it. Oh, yeah, right here. We find the skull. We can just run past her. We have to find a pile of... I Why am I stuck? No! Oh, my head hurts. Basically... That is this whole game. It is literally a scavenger hunt of, um, I guess this weird character. And they tried to morph it between Rod and Granny and try to, try to capitalize on people who do not know what, uh, the real versions are. And this one is so just weird and, and broken and crazy. I mean, it's so bad that it's funny. And I think that's the most cool thing here. But nevertheless, I think I'm gonna leave it here. I feel like, I feel like I've had enough of this game. I need to cleanse myself after playing this. It's weird. I am, I'm a guy with a bat going and stealing stuff from a wizard's house. Like, why were, why was all the stuff like, like a witch and wizard based? And why, why was this granny holding a bat patrolling her house in a neighborhood where it's kind of like the smallest town? It's kind of like a story where like, <laughs> we're just the neighbor that keeps stealing her stuff. And she's like, you know, Eric, stop coming over to my house and stealing all my wizard and witch stuff. But nevertheless, hopefully it made you laugh here today. That's all I want to do. I just want to make you laugh every single day. So, thank you for watching. If you're new, please subscribe to join the DAC Pack going strong towards 700k now. It's weird to say. I've been saying 600k for so long and now we finally got there. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. There's a new video probably coming up right now and we're about to have some fun. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in that next video. And as always, peace out, my dudes.